going. In three, two, one, and action. Michael. Going into this film, uh, I knew it was going to be very different to all the other films I've made before. Nat is much younger than all the other directors. <laughs> Which is weird. It's a little scary because I don't really have anybody else that I can split the work with or help with, but <laughs> Nat's been like pulling me through it a lot. It's, been, it's made it a lot easier than it it is. So I'm not really all into that mushy stuff, so oh, okay. it's not it's not my forte. Uh, Nathaniel came into my work, Youth Services, City of Darwin. Come to support him, He's filmmaking, young people, they've got talent. And why why are you here on set? Extra of the year award, hoping for. Ten out of ten. When I can't get it, he shows me how to do it. And he knows exactly what he wants, he knows how to show me how to do it as well. He's, no better teacher than have. We started off on our first day of filming um, at the Fanny Bay Jail. That sounded ambitious, definitely. Cyclone Tracy, it's epic. And so tackling that in a short film, I did wonder how he was going to do it. This production has had the most people I've ever had in on one production. And um, I think organising all those people was pretty scary. My name's Celeste Club. And uh, what's your character? You're in a nurse's outfit. Yeah, I'm just a nurse. And that's pretty much it. Dad! 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 I think it's gone well so far. I think it'll turn out really well. Yeah. After everything's been put together. From when I wrote it to when I went to production, it was a completely different story. And then from production to the edit suite, it was another completely different story too. <laughs> Um, hey guys, just really quickly before we head over, this is video. Okay, everyone, just take us back into the same costumes you uh, were in before. So we're getting ready to shoot another scene now. Um, how do you prepare for the for shooting? I don't know. Just to get in the character, I just I'll make a character. And I'll give it his personality and his history, and then I'll imagine that there's two doors in my head. And one door opens and Mason goes out and the character comes in and I'm stuck in that zone for a while. And then when acting's all done, I do the exact same process, opens up, character comes out, Mason comes back in. It's a weird process, but it helps. It works so far. <laughs> I don't know anyone who can do this better. Well, the director's coming over. Don't now. worry, the director's coming over. Everything's fine. All fine here. Uh, top director. I reckon he's going to go far in his directing career. Here he is, old mate. Here you go, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I'll, keep I'll, keep, I'll keep that money, okay? <laughs> no worries. Yeah, he'll go far in his career. <laughs> what are your impressions of the film so far? The film? Quite emotional. It's a bit of a roller coaster. You don't know where it's going. It's like riding on the um, on the No Limit blindfolded, I would say. It's a good analogy. Yeah. Do you know where your parents are? Do you know where your parents are? Thomas gave us a bigger kind of picture to look at when Nat gave us what he wanted. It was, it was cool to have both. Very cool. Me being around the actors, I think it's I think I'm a good influence. I think they see me and like I'm kind of an example for them. And I'm like, this is what I could be if I act well in a Nat Kelly film. Is this actually a video selfie? Yeah, it's, it's rolling right now. And my wrist is bending. What do you do in a video selfie? Try not to drop the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Looks tough. So Mason excited for today? No! Uh, why not? Because the wildlife doesn't like me. How are you feeling about today's shoot before going into it? Um, 
Yeah, it's one of those things, isn't it, where, like, if I thought about it too much, I'd freeze and, like, wouldn't be able to do anything. But, so I try not to think about it. Check in uh, camera raincoats. How is it, Mason? F you terrible. Hey. He's just like, no, thank you. I'm a pig. <laughs> Video diary one. Uh, Mason just dug a hole and filled it up again. Now he's getting friendly with the dog, I think. No, nope. maybe not so friendly. Uh, diary entry seven or something. Um, we just filmed a, a, a scene with a fire and it's still burning out there. It's probably gonna burn for several more generations. Oh jeez, he's always behind you. Oh jeez, that's the director. Oh jeez. There's, there's just... No, there's no one. That's what it's like here on set. Is the light on Mason? Yeah. Alright, in three, two, one. And <laughs> three, two, one, wall. I'm actually liking what Mason's looking like right now, and I want to go for another take like that. <laughs> two, one, wall. What? In three, two, one, action. I was uh, happy that he wanted to continue working with me. Uh, you know, every project could be our last, um, in a way. Not really. I think we'll, we'll work together for a long time yet. Well, I started uh, work on this film in April 2014, and that brought me up until January 2015. And so I think it was an incredibly long time to be working on one project. I don't think I'd want to spend that much time on another project anytime soon. So it's great. Uh, he's, he's always thinking um, about ways to extend the project and it's like, it seems quite 24-7 for him. And I think that's how it should be.